In this video, guys, I'm going to show you how to trace this face to have an artwork. It's going to be very beautiful, don't worry. And of course, we are going to use the width tool later on to be able to make it even better. So let's start. I'm going to zoom in just over here. Okay. And I'll double click on the pencil tool to make sure fidelity is to the maximum. And I want it to keep selected. And the option key will toggle to the smooth tool. So I will click and start dragging. Okay. As slow as you want. There is no hurry. Don't you think if you go speedier, you're going to have less anchor points. It won't happen. In fact, I'm going to stop here. Notice it's really smooth with two anchor points only. I'm going to continue. Okay, go faster now a bit. Okay, here you are. I made a mistake, you know, it just jumped over here. It doesn't matter. I'm going to continue from here. And if I release, you notice it disappears. I'm going to go on. Okay, I need to make some mistakes to show you. Okay, I'm going to make a mistake. Here it is. And I stop here. So you notice it's not very smooth with me. I'm going to press the option key and then start moving it. And you will see it's going to come out very nicely. Let's come over here and continue. Now I'm not sure how we continued because it seems there was others. Okay, I'm going to go up. Okay, I have a problem here. I'm going to smooth it out again and again. If it's not working with you at all, smoothing it. All you have to do is to redo the path. Okay, though you could have gone to the white tool and did a lot of magic, but this will do. So that seems fine. I'm going to correct it a bit from here. So I click on the path and re-click or end on the path. Here you are. Now I'm going to continue. Okay, want to do the lips. I'm going to zoom in even more. Okay, I like it that way. Actually, it's too much. And then go for the lips. Okay, and then continue this side. So I have the whole heart cornered here. Press the option key or alt on the PC and here you are. You can smoothen it the way you would like. Not bad. Okay, so here I'm going to do another line just up to here. It looks smooth, not bad. Now I have to select this one. So the way to select is to press command and select it. You know, I went to the other one. So you press the command key and here you are, you are in selection tool. You can select this one or this one. That's the way to reselect. Then let's move in here. I'm pressing option or alt on the PC. I'm going to do the lips here. Cool. I'm going to continue. A bit speedier now. Here you are. Not bad. That's the chin, I think. Let's zoom out a bit. Okay. Not bad. That will work fine. And let's go just like this. You know, I'm not trying to be precise at 100%, but I'm trying my best. Okay, I messed up very big here. I could change it. I go on the path and move over here to change it. Didn't work very fine. In fact, I cut it. I'm going to undo. Go ahead like this and then go down. I think this is pretty cool. Option key, alt on the PC and try to smoothen it as much as possible. Not working very well. But you get what I mean. Okay, here I need it to be a bit like this. Some awesome details to add is this guy here. Okay, you notice the line? It's very nice. Some nice more detail to add is the nose. So I'm going to be very meticulous and try to curve it the way it is. Not bad at all. Very nice. Let's do the eye. I'm going to zoom in and do something like this. And then something like this. This is too harsh here. I'm going to adjust it. So I'm going to go like this and stop it here. And then again, like this. Smoothen it with the smoother. I'm pressing option now. Okay, make it straight for me. Yeah, I think this is okay. So we're going to put the eye just like this. And if you want, you can add this detail here that I'm sure will give you something quite beautiful. Let's go up. Now we have the eyebrows. I'm going to start from the outside and here like this and like this. It's very long. I'm going to go for the white arrow or the direct selection and select this one and just bring it in. You now something just like this. I like that until now. Fine. Let's focus on the ear now. It's going to be pretty nice, guys. I hope you're doing that. I hope you will do that. So I'm going to press N for the pen tool and draw the ear. 
Okay, you don't want to be very meticulous. Remember, you're creating an artwork. I like it. Then from over here, but I'm going to make it a curve. Okay. I'm going to do this curve just like this. And from here, maybe I'll do something like this. <laughs> Not bad at all. Let's zoom out. Now, from the back, I'm going to do the back just here. Something like this. Here you are. It's very easy. Very beautiful. Okay, notice here. Actually, it's doing very well with me. Cool. I'm going to smooth it down here. There is another, but it really doesn't matter. You can do it like this. Fine. Let's zoom out. Control zero. And actually, you might look at this and say, wow, okay. But using the width tool is going to be better. Let's go to layers. Find there is the girl here, you notice, and just put it off. So actually, you have something very beautiful. Of course, now I'm talking, I'm trying my best, in fact. The eye could use an adjustment, but actually we came up with something very nice. For the hair. Now, since we want to use the width tool, I'm going to do the hair in a certain way where we can use the width tool. It's going to be something just like this, for example, okay? So, how to do these lines? Very easy. Just click and to your taste. And another one. I'm going with the comb. Okay. And we do the last one maybe. And another one just like this. Something like this. It will look very nice later on when we're using the width tool. Actually, I want to add a bit more. And that's it. It's pretty nice. I want to add another one here. I should stop playing. <laughs> okay. Now that you have traced it, we are going to go ahead and learn about the width tool and make it even better and do the others. Just to give you, you know, just something to play with. I'm going to click here, command zero. Notice how you'll do this one. Let's do this one. Now, bud is coming up and things like this. So you can come over and start, you know, redesigning all this. For the eyes, of course, I copied them from an image. But you can come over and just play with them, for example, just like this. And remember, you can reach for the direct selection tool. Try to adjust certain things, of course. It's an anchor point, so you can play with the handles if you want to. Usually, you will correct it. So we're going to continue for the next video and learning how to use the width tool and do some amendments to the work that you have done over here. I'll see you then.